talk some real care shit Been in my bag, bitch, I'm doing real fine I'm doing better than all of my ops I pop shit on the gram and in real life Talk that talk, I'ma walk that walk I only speak facts None of these bitches is seeing me And that's just that I don't that Stay down ten toes, I'm a real bitch I don't play around What it do YouTube, what's new, it's your girl Vivi and I'm back another day, another dollar, you feel me, and in today's video, <laughs> your girl got a package, I can't show y'all the next time, but your girl got a package, this video is sponsored by the Barbie Boutique, they sent me, I think some lashes, they sent me some lashes, I believe, so yeah, this video is sponsored by them, um, in this video, I'm finna do a Q&A, which I'm pretty sure you know by the title. I asked you guys, I asked YouTube, Instagram, Snap, everywhere, um, to send me any questions that you guys have for me. Because, you know, I haven't done an updated Q&A in a year. A lot has changed. So, I asked you guys, you know, for all my new supporters, all my new subscribers, what questions you got for me? You guys sent me a lot of questions. Um, So, yeah, I'm finna do an updated q and A. I'm gonna do my makeup. Well, you know, I do the q and I'm going to try. But yeah, this video is sponsored by the Barbie Boutique. So you guys, make sure you guys go shop, cop that some lashes. The link will be in the description below. And you guys can obviously see the Instagram on the screen, the website. So make sure you guys go buy it up. I do have a discount code, she said. So, yeah. But before we get into all that, make sure you like, comment, if you're new to the channel, subscribe, hit that post notification bell to get notified every time I post, upload, or do anything on the channel. Because it coming with me and only y'all. And let's get straight into this video. Alright y'all, so I just opened my package. Oh my god, it looks so cute. So, that is the item right there. Did I drop something? So, this is the package, y'all. It came in the packaging, and this is how it comes. Looks like I got a scrunchie, the um, a eyelash um tweezer, and the eyelashes, which is nice. I just want to make sure I didn't drop the code or anything, cause I I guess she put it inside of here, like the the card, cause she told me that I had a discount code card. Oh, it's inside the bag. All right, so when you take um, you open the bag, you get a scrunchie, like a hair scrunchie. Which is cute. I'm definitely actually going to wear that. Oh, there's more in here, you guys. First up, before I continue, I just wanted to say thank you. Because like, she really came through, y'all. She really sent me this. And she was on it. Like, when I texted her, she was on it. So, yeah. This is the last style. Is on I can't I can't pronounce things right. But bear with me. Y'all going gonna, gonna to see. Because it's going to be in the description yeah but and it's on the screen so i'm sorry if i pronounce it wrong but pronouncing people names with like that is like my worst thing ever but my code is riri 20 for 20 percent off you guys so make sure you guys go shop because i got a code for me and yeah she she gave me like a, on the back of it i got the um the business information the phone number you know the email the website all of that so you guys make sure y'all go use my code and y'all buy because like are you shitting me why wouldn't you but yeah also it came with these are the lashes i'm gonna show you guys that in a second but it also came with this you know that eyelash eyelashes brush the tweezers with the hair scrunchie and then these are the lashes y'all y'all cannot tell me that these lashes is not cute like y'all just cannot tell me that these lashes are not cute like are you are you shaming me right now <laughs> good girl yo yeah and i have a lot of lashes i have a lot of lashes so already looking at these lashes i love them the packaging is so cute y'all do y'all see that oh my god it looks so cute y'all Oh my, and it's long, baby. And it's long, baby. But these are the lashes, y'all. These are the lashes. But look. They are long. They're giving me pretty isolating vibes. Not gonna lie. That Barbie right there, she be her. Her lashes be up. 
and she asked me and i was like i didn't mind because i actually do want to try long lashes i have like a couple but i've never had like long arms so i was like i know i know big but not to sit out so yeah y'all these are the lashes we finna be putting on today do y'all see that i gotta show y'all one more time if you're not shopping with her what are you doing if you're not copping what are you doing baby what are you doing like and i'm gonna tell y'all right now for all that that wants me to promote their stuff and stuff like that i will do that hit me up on instagram at creamy relief or you can email me on my business email at ririgang01 at gmail.com and if the stuff is bad y'all i'm finna tell y'all i don't care how much i'm getting paid to promote something i'm finna tell y'all so we're finna use this other phone of mine this is not my phone let me just clarify that now this is not my phone okay this was a temporary phone from apple when i broke my seven but i have an 11 so like yes so we're gonna start doing my makeup i'm gonna try to answer the questions as i do my makeup i'm also trying not to make this too long okay so the first question is crush um crush i don't have um i don't know it's just me i don't have a crush so i don't really know what to tell y'all about that one because Aldrich said i don't have a crush if you get what i'm saying my middle name my only middle name i'm telling you guys is sanaya because i feel like my next one I, I hate my next middle name i don't like it um it's just not me but yeah so the only middle name i'm gonna tell you guys is sanaya that's the only middle name i'm gonna tell you guys okay the next question is when's your birthday my birthday is New Year's Day, baby, January 1st, 2002. So, yes, I am 18 years old, okay? Um, Next question is my shoe size. I don't know why you guys want to know my shoe size, but if it's because you're sending me shoes, I'm a six, okay? My feet are pretty small. Like, in some things, I have to get a five and a half. Like, I think my Uggs, my Uggs, I think it's a five and a half. But, yeah, sneaker-wise, like, Jordans and stuff, I'm a six. Um, Oh, if y'all want a video on how I do my makeup, let me know. I'm not a makeup pro, y'all, but I watch videos and I learn. So, yeah, if you want to know how I do my makeup, let me know. Um, Next is your YouTube crush. <laughs> I just got off the phone saying that I don't consider him my YouTube crush, but... I guess that he is because y'all, I be watching his videos like crazy. So, my old YouTube crush, which I feel like will forever be one of one of my YouTube crushes, is Smoogio. Because like, if you don't watch his stuff, like you're missing out a lot. Like, he's funny as hell. But my recent, not recent, recent, but recent um YouTube crush is Zay. Zay too wavy, y'all. Zay too wavy. If you watch this, hi. <laughs> y'all know I'm shy around people, but yeah, I'm not too shy. But yeah, Zay too wavy. Y'all gotta go subscribe to him. I'm telling y'all right now, like that boy. We not we not even get to it. Like I'm gonna just leave it like that. Um, my next is the next question. Is my biggest fear so my biggest fear used to be death till i realized like you can't control that feel me so i would say now my biggest fear is not being successful before i go not making it to where i want to be before you know god brings me home that is my biggest fear because you know there's so much going on and like I want to, like, get to where I want to be in life before, you know, not even, like, cause you, just because I make it doesn't mean I want to, you know, leave it. But I want to, like, at least get to, you know, say I did some things before I go. So that's my biggest fear, not being successful, not getting to where I want to be before I'm dead. Like, that's it, because you never know you going now. Um, my next question is, do you have a boyfriend? 
Um, I don't want to say I don't. Let's just say I'm working on my future. And I feel like that's not really anybody's business till I bring my boyfriend on YouTube. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for that. Next question is, what's your favorite color? Um, my favorite color is white. And I love white because it's in, like an original. To me, white shows original. And like, you know, white helps make every other color. Some people might disagree, but that's just how I think. My favorite color is white. One of a kind. So yeah. Next, it says best friend. Yes, I have a best friend. Her name is Darren. If you do not know, um, if you did not watch my birthday vlog, that is my best friend. I realized I messed up on my makeup, but whatever. Yeah, that's my best friend. Um, it's gonna be a year that we've been best friends in October. I want to say in October is gonna make a year that we have been best friends. But that's my bestie, and I love her with all my heart. Even though she gets on my nerves sometimes. Yeah, she can get on my nerve. But I love her dearly. Next question is my height. I'm 5'3", I believe. I'm 5'3". Um, I'm pretty short in person. But to my family members, I'm tall. I don't know why. Because, like, I just don't know why. But I'm pretty short in person, I would say. So, yeah, I'm 5'3". Three. Next is ever ate an edible. I have never, ever, ever ate an edible. And I see a lot of YouTubers doing that. Um, I ate an edible and tried to do my makeup. Or I ate an edible and cooked. I don't know how I feel about doing that. But if you guys want me to do it, I guess. You know. I wouldn't be here without you guys. So if you guys want me to do it, I guess. But I really don't know how I feel about doing that because... You know, like I said, I never eat edible. So it's just like, if you get what I'm saying. Next is, what teams have you danced on? Um, I don't know how I feel about this question because I really don't want to be naming teams. <laughs> but I danced with, um, whew, let's see. I'm not going to go in any order. I've danced with EFV cheerleaders. They cheer for Tilden High School. Um, but we did competitive. It was competitive cheerleading. So I danced with Dom. Um, I've danced with Left Out Mark. I've danced with Young Elites. I've danced with Short and Shy. Um who else? I currently dance in my school. Um, yeah, that's basically the tops. Like, but I've danced with a lot of people, I would say. Those basically the top ones that I could remember. Oh, for, oh I've also danced with, um, what is that team called? I don't even remember their names. Um, Untouchable Movement. I've danced with them too. Next, um, what's your TikTok? I'm going to just put that on the screen, y'all, because I don't remember my TikTok name. What's the biggest thing you've ever did and got caught doing? So, the biggest thing I've ever done and got caught doing? Um, I want to say sneaking out the house because I wasn't at my house. And I snuck out the house and I went somewhere without permission, so... Yeah, I want to say sneaking out the house. Stay tuned for that story time. I'm going to just leave that as a story time. Stay tuned for that. Um, Next is, what did you, how, how did you get over a relationship? How did you get over your last relationship? Um, I didn't. <laughs> I didn't. Um, I don't want to say, like, 
you're gonna get over things because you know i do move past things i do get over them but the best way i could say is distract yourself try to think of things that's gonna help you go to where you want to be try working on your future i would say that's the best way i see it next question is Something you hate, y'all. I got a new subscriber. Hey, y'all, you know what I hate? Liars. 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 Okay? I can't stand them, mother. I can't stand them. I hate liars. Like, I hate liars. Like, all jokes aside. And I know some people who might feel some type of way or anything i don't i don't even care i really just hate straight up hate liars like i don't like liars because if you lie to me i can't trust you like i'm like the most easiest person you can talk to tell anything to i'll be able to help you but when you lie to me like how you lie to other people it's just like how am i supposed to like you know defend you and stuff to you lying to do like a little eyeliner but i don't know how to do it so forgive me y'all <laughs> forgive me i'm trying to do it this is hard like talking and doing your makeup is hard next is what's the most embarrassing thing you've ever done that's what somebody asks the most embarrassing thing i've ever done <laughs> Um, I'm going to save this because I don't want to use this yet. I don't want to get dirty. So, the most embarrassing thing I've ever done was... Hmm. That really got me thinking. The most embarrassing thing I've ever done. I want to say that when I was younger, I was in charter school. And my teacher wouldn't let me use the bathroom. Because if you go to charter school, you already know. Like, you know, you cannot use the bathroom. So my teacher wouldn't let me use the bathroom. So I straight up peed on myself. Bitch! In front of the whole class. And then, you know, she, she called my mom. And my mom came. My mom yelled at her and then took me out of school. Like, she picked me up for the day, and I got to change my clothes to, like, this nice little sundress. I don't know. I think that's the most pretty, like, the most pretty embarrassing thing I've ever done. Like, with no help or it wasn't purposely. Yeah, I peed on myself. But don't call me no, no names in the comments, because if you ain't peeing on yourself when you was younger, then what are you doing? Because I know everybody peed on, your, peed on themselves, like... You're wearing a diaper. You you technically peed on yourself. All right. Next up, if you could do a rap collab, who would it be with? <laughs> That's a good ass question. I ain't gonna lie. If I could do a rap collab, um, with a girl, I would say like up there a little bit or whatever you wanna call it wise. I would say I would do it with Famous Ocean and Kung Fu. I don't know, they just, they vibe is just, it's with it. I'm with a boy. Uh, woo! Woo! These things are long. Yeah, I was not expecting this. Like, I mean, it looked long and I wanted to try long, but like, these are long. They long, long. Like, oh my God. How do y'all girls do it? I'm afraid, like, I'm afraid to blink. <laughs> How do y'all do these? However y'all do it, hey, I'm no longer talking shit. I give y'all all the props, cause yeah. I feel like maybe cause I'm not used to it, but like, damn, like. All jokes aside, how do y'all do these? Cause baby, I'm afraid to blink. Look, at it's, it's coming off a little bit. I gotta fix it, y'all. <laughs> like, y'all, I don't know how some people do these. But, like, I'm afraid to literally. 
yeah that was the last question who i collab with um for boy wise of collabing am i gonna lie to y'all i really don't know because like i know some boy rappers but like i mean like up there up there with like you know up there up there i don't know i have no idea he said are you willing to do collabs if so with who yeah y'all um i'm not gonna lie to y'all i have collabs coming the one thing that like really slowed down like my collabs was one people would say they're ready to collab and then when you text them they don't answer or they never like have free time or shit like that but i actually do have two collabs on the way i'm not gonna say with who you know you gotta just wait and see to make sure you guys actually see but um yeah basically people just they just say things and then when it comes to collabing you know the virus also nobody wants to be in people's house because the virus nobody want nobody in their house because of the virus so yeah it's just a lot when it comes to that but i would I, i'm willing to collab with um a lot of people like anybody like it doesn't even have to be that you know i have more subscribers or supporters than you just for the fact that you know you're taking you're taking youtube serious i would collab with you i don't want nobody to collab with me that's not gonna take youtube serious you get what i'm saying because it's like me wasting my time i take my time very seriously um next it says who do you look who do you think you look like out of your mom and your dad um i feel like i look like my mom i don't know i look like my dad's side of the family i'm not gonna lie to you Get into it, get into it, baby. Nah, now nah, I'm really liking these lashes, y'all. I mean, I was loving them before, but baby, do you see them? Do you see the link? Like, do you see them? Like, y'all making me want to do my hair, go outside, take pictures in this dark outside and stuff. Like, I'm finna, like, take out my hair and, well, not take out my hair, but take off my bonnet, do my hair, and take some pictures. Like, I'm not going to lie to y'all. Like, do y'all see this? Get in tune, baby. Get in tune. If y'all not shopping with her, what are you doing? What are you doing, baby? Y'all know I don't do my eyebrows, so listen, okay? I'm finna learn. Get me. Don't say nothing. Don't say nothing. Don't, don't, don't even look at me like that. You, yeah, you. Don't look at me like that. I'm finna, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get to learn to do my eyebrows. I'm gonna get to learn to do them. I actually am about to order some stuff for my eyebrows. And I'm gonna go to the beauty supply store and get some stuff for my eyebrows. Because, you know, for beginners, I don't want to waste some $28 eye thing from India or somebody. You know, that's what I want to get. But I'm not finna waste that. I don't want to ruin the pink one. I'm gonna take the black one. I'm not finna waste that. You know? And now I'm not do eyebrows yet, so. Are you crazy? Tuh. Y'all need to get in tune for real, for real. Like, you're not shopping. You're not shopping with the Barbie boutique. Then you, I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing, y'all. Let's finish these questions, shall we? Next is what inspired you to do YouTube? By the way, I love you, sis. Aw, thank you. What inspired me to do YouTube? Um, my first video that I ever uploaded, which you guys don't see because I deleted it, of course. But I was about 13 years old and I was dancing. Um, what inspired me to do YouTube? Basically, I uploaded the video and I had like two likes or something like that. And I thought I was popping because I was like, somebody liked my video. But I realized later on that I looked crazy, so I deleted it. <laughs> um, I don't think that nothing really inspired me, but for the fact that I've always like wanted to be, I don't want to say popular. I've always wanted to be an inspiration for people, like to let people know that you can do anything. I always wanted to help people. I'm very helpful. Sometimes that's not too good, but I'm very, very helpful. Um, so, yeah, I've done a lot that made me, like, 
get into where I'm, I am, if I should say. I've auditioned for Disney Channel. I've gotten, um, they just want too much money. But I've done that. I've done modeling. I've done cheerleading. Um, you know, like, I don't want to say girly sports, but you know, like, the sports that people nowadays, they look for people on Instagram, like, oh, this is a cheerleader. And they got, like, 50,000 50, followers just because they can do a trick or stuff like that. I feel like what inspired me to do YouTube was just me personally, how I I want the world to see what I can do. And I want that to like motivate other people and inspire other people to what they could do. So I guess that's what inspired me to do YouTube. I want to be able to inspire others. So yeah, I inspired myself, I guess. <laughs> um, Next question is, well, this is not even a question, but somebody said AIDS, exotic sign, most expensive thing you have what are you going to college for if you go that was a lot Whew. so age like i said before i'm 18 zodic sign it's like psychotic zodic whatever how zodic sign because i don't know why i'm saying it wrong um i'm a capricorn i'm born january 1st 2002 so i'm a capricorn i start all y'all birthdays off. like come on now next is most expensive thing that you have that was in the question most expensive thing that I have, um, I don't really look at, you know, getting a lot of expensive things. I'm, I mean, all my stuff in total is expensive. I'm an expensive person. And that's why I want to make it because I want to be able to buy myself those expensive things. So I guess the most expensive thing I have is my phone that I got myself. My iPhone 11, I guess. Um, cause yeah, I got it when it first came out. Next, the next part of that question is, what are you going to college for if you go? I'm going to college to study business. Yeah. I want to study business when I go to college. So business, I think business administration. I believe that's what, you know, it's called. I had to get my lip gloss. New subscriber. Hey, I get all y'all notifications, my job. Every time somebody subscribes, I get your notification. So, yeah, that's it right there. Um, I'm going for business administration. Um, I am going to college. I really want to. I want to go out of state, but, you know, I heard that college is going to be two times more expensive because it is virus and it's riot. They're going to need to pay for stuff. So, not saying that I can't go, but I'd rather not waste so much money on going away for college when I can stay here for the first two years and then go away for my last two years, if it makes sense. So, I don't know. I'm more so on going away. But if I get into this one college in New York, I'm actually going to stay in New York. I'm not going to stay at home. I'm going to either get my own apartment or live on campus. But if I get into that college because it's a private university, then, yeah, I'm going to stay because I really want to go to that. Um... Next question is, during the summer, if there was no quarantine, will you be able to do collabs? If during the summer there's no quarantine, I'm going to do collabs. Um, like I said before, I'm open to collabs. So if you guys want me to collab with any YouTuber, I don't care how big the YouTuber is, tag them or put their name in the comments, you feel me? Um, I would Instagram, like DM some YouTubers, stuff like that. But some, by some people are like cocky. And I don't want to, like, you know, put myself out there, make it seem like I'm fiending for nobody. Because I'm not fiending for nobody. I'm not fiending for nobody collab. If you get what I'm saying. So, but yeah, if y'all comment, and I'm pretty sure they see y'all comments, I'm pretty sure they'll, you know, they'll be like, yeah, sure, we can collab. Some people are open to it. Some people only want to collab with certain people. So, I don't know. But I'm open to doing collabs. Um, Favorite ex. That, oh. You dumb, stupid, or dumb, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Last question is, what part of Brooklyn are you from? Um, I'm not from Brooklyn. But, um... Saying where I am or where I be at in Brooklyn, I feel like is a bad idea. <laughs> um, my grandmother might kill me if I say where I be at in Brooklyn because it's just like, 
you know, you're going to say where you be at and, you know, people shouldn't know where you be at. If you get what I'm saying. So, for my safety, again, I don't want to make it seem like I'm better than anybody or anything like that. All jokes aside, for my safety, for you guys' safety, for the people I be around safety, I'm not going to technically answer that question, like, all the way. Let's just say I be out and about in Brooklyn. I'm not from Brooklyn, but I be out and about. Um, everywhere, I want to say. Because I literally do. So, yeah, I be out and about. Best way to put it. Anywho, you guys, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, if you to the channel, subscribe, hit that post notification bell, get notified every time I post, upload, do anything on the channel because we come in with only you guys and get in tune to these lashes. Do y'all see it? Do y'all see it? Baby, get in tune. Get in tune. Like, y'all, it came in a cute ass packaging. Like, come on out. Come on out. She blessed y'all, girl. And make sure y'all use the code. It's going to be on the screen in the description below. My code. So that way you, ugh, my code, so that way you guys can get 20% off on your purchase. And all that. Ads. Yeah, girl, get up there. I'm being sponsored by people and stuff. So, yeah. And once again, this video is sponsored by the Barbie Boutique. So, make sure you guys go cop it up. Because if you're not copying from her, if you're not copying from her, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Like, what are you doing? All right. I'm going to go do my hair, you guys. And then I'm going to take some pictures. I'm probably going to insert it at the end of this video. If I don't, follow me on Instagram at Queen Marie Lee. It's on the screen in the description down below. So go run it up. And yeah, y'all see my pictures there if I don't post it at the end of the video. Because sometimes I don't like how it looks at the end of the video. I don't like how it looks. But yeah. I thank you guys for watching. Later, Ruby Gang. Hashtag Ruby Nation. Fuck, I look like going back and forth with a little bitch that is not on my level. I do not give a fuck. Tell a bitch, try her luck. She'll get folded like a pretzel.